Miss Cools has uh, used tire blues today. <laughs> used tire blues. <laughs> the used tire blues. I let her borrow some tires that I took off of my bike. I don't even know. What was it six months ago? I got these new tires, so I took those off. Well, I didn't realize there was a, there was a thorn in one of them, and it, okay. you only find you only remember that once you've taken the tire off and put it on another tire on another tube, and then pump it up six months later, and you get a flat five minutes into the ride. I feel That's, like I was set up. <laughs> this was a total setup. <laughs> Oh God. Just think of what you're learning though from this experience. Okay, this is my technique to getting enough air in these overly wide tires. I, 10 pumps, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 10. And I have to take a break. Right. It's like doing push-ups in the military. Yeah. <laughs> they say, give me 50. So you drop, you do 10 and then you take a break, do 10 more until you get 50. Yeah, so these are what, 48 millimeter tires. They're Pana Racer Gravel Kings. They're actually, they measure out pretty wide. You probably measure out to 50. And uh, we did run 50 millimeter tires here. We ran them because we were first setting up this bike. But as you can see, there's, there's very, very little clearance on these with these brakes. They do fit. Uh, is there a safety issue? I mean, it's Miss Cool, so even if there is, it's cool. uh, maybe. <laughs> uh. is there a safety issue with that, Miss Cools? Maybe not with that. I mean, I have plenty of other safety issues, but maybe not that one. Okay. tires and the reason I put these on is because my Pan Racer 42s they were really thin and I kept getting flat tires on them the tread pattern or the tread was just like paper thin compared to uh, most tires I guess um, so I kept getting flats and uh, I finally decided to take them off for a while give myself a rake from flat so I put these old gravel kings on and uh, we'll see if they help. Although yeah. I did have one flat this morning already, but that was, that doesn't count because that was from a thorn that was already in the tire that I didn't know about. But for future flat prevention, hopefully it'll help. What'd you get, Miss Cools? 
This is a uh, blackberry lime. Let's go. Can I have half of it? As long as you get give me the bigger half. Yeah. Okay, let's let's try. Whoa. Blackberry lime, ladies and gentlemen. Blackberry lime. smooth you know I really want to tell you something Miss Coles oh yeah I think you're really smooth you're a really smooth cyclist really especially around those corners back there okay <laughs> I'm glad that I'm putting off that uh, ambiance so pro tip is that you go to the best bakery in all of Northern California and then you bring them over to the coffee shop of your choice because the best pastries are not always in the good coffee shops. And the good coffee shops don't always have the best pastries. Exactly. So, pro tip. You get the best of both worlds that way. That's right. And that's why one of these little bags can come in handy for you to enhance your bakery coffee experience. Blueberry lime scone, look at that. Let's see who they gave that got the bigger one. Oh dang, I think yours won. It definitely won. <laughs> yours has more powdered sugar on it though. Okay, yeah, I so guess you I, won. I won in the powdered sugar department.